Hello queens and welcome back. It is Queen of Queen She Me and today I have a beauty video for you guys. I know, right? It's been a while since I've actually done a beauty video because I have honestly and truly really have kind of gravitated away from all that stuff. I still have a couple of things. I did actually do like a detox of stuff, so I just kind of just went through and just got rid of a whole bunch of stuff. So today's beauty video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys my favorite fragrances. And y'all, I'm not really a girl who likes to wear a whole lot of different fragrances, but I do have my favorites that I do wear year round. And I mean year round, I mean year round. Now, a couple of them I was introduced to over the last year that just passed. And I have just fallen in love with them. And I honestly and truly don't feel like I need any other scent. So without further ado, let's get right into today's beauty video. Okay, guys. So the first scent that I'm going to be sharing with you guys is actually going to be from the same brand. It's going to be Martin Jacobs. Y'all know I love floral scents. I love flowers. I love the springtime. I like being outdoors. I love colors. So anything that pretty much reminds me of that, I am down for it. And especially too because I'm a Taurus and I'm born in the springtime. So yes, I love anything spring and alive and just vibrant and just, it just smells so good. So the first one I'm going to share with you guys is actually the first one I ever used from them. And this is the Marc Jacobs, um, Daisy toilet. Now the Daisy ones, there are different ones and this is the pink one here. And I'm a rollerball girl. I don't have to have like those huge, huge packagings because one, if I decide to travel, I don't want to worry about trying to condense down like my fragrances because you know if it's too big, they will actually make you throw it away. So I like rollerballs. They're more convenient and if I say, you know, I want to put some more on throughout the day, I can just toss this in my purse and I'm good to go. So the reason why I like this pink one Oh my gosh, it's because it's so soft. It reminds me really of like a um, peony fi um, flower. Um, if you guys don't know what peonies are, they're like those small little pink flowers. Um, and they're easy to grow. You can grow them annually. And I love them. And they just smell so fr freaking good. They have like a very soft scent. It's not overpowering whatsoever. And if you decide to put a little bit more on, you won't, you know, in a sense be like bam in your face with your perfume because you know some perfumes can be pretty strong and like in your face and i'm not into all those kind of perfumes but i have worn some of those in the past now it is one from victoria's secrets called vixen and i really do like that one a lot but, so i love this one again from Mark jacobs and this is the daisy one and the pink one um of course i don't know the name of it oh wait is it on the bottom here no it's not on the bottom here but this is a toilet I think I need to mention that, yes. So, you know, toilets and perfumes can be a little bit stronger in sense, and toilets are a lot softer. And I prefer those, but I do like perfumes as well. So, again, this is Marc Jacobs Daisy, and this is the pink one, y'all. And I love this freaking scent. Like, it smells so good. And if you're one of those people that, you know, don't wear a lot of fragrances, but you want to wear something, you know, light, or if you want to start getting into fragrances, that is the one I would highly recommend for anyone to try out. So, the next one is also from Marc Jacobs as well, you guys. And this is the white one um, from the Daisy collection. And I like this one um, a lot. Now I got this one in a duo set from um, Sephora for $20. And it has this one and the pink one, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it has the pink one. So that one's empty, but we do have a back one on backup. So you can obviously tell I like Marc Jacobs. And so, yes, again, this came in a duo set from Sephora. I actually have an unboxing here on my channel from like over a year ago. So that just goes to show you too, I don't wear perfumes every single day as well. So this is a toilet as well. This one does smell a little different. It has a little bit stronger scent. Um, I would probably compare this one to probably, um, I wouldn't say Lily's because it's not sweet in that kind of a sense, um, but it is a little bit stronger than the pink one. So there is a slight difference. This one is a little bit stronger, but not overbearing as well. So say like, you know, you're kind of like on an edgy mood, but you're still like want to be real soft. This will be the one for you. And then the pink one would be for like, if you just want to be like your real girly girl self, real soft, real gentle, put this one on. But again, this one is soft as well. It's not overbearing. And Marc Jacobs, again, they have various sizes, various patterns packagings of their um, perfumes and toilets and I like the smaller packagings again for travel purposes and honestly and truly the larger ones are a lot more expensive so if you don't wear a lot of perfume on a regular basis like every day and you're just putting it on I would just go with the small travel size packaging or again the rollerball the rollerballs individually are usually like $33 which isn't bad at all I feel because again it's a 
you know, a name brand toilet and it is, you know, of a good quality. So it's not like it's, you know, the price isn't like bad. So I would definitely repurchase it, obviously. So again, this is the one with the white packaging and this one is a little bit stronger than the one in the pink packaging. Okay, girl. <laughs> All right, you guys, so continuing on, this is another one from Marc Jacobs. I should have just made this, I should have just titled this my favorite Marc Jacobs fragrances. I should have just really titled that because I only have another one that isn't, well, actually two more that aren't from Marc Jacobs, to be honest. So, <laughs> so this one is the Decadence one, and I got this one in an Influencer box. If you don't know what Influencer is, you can sign up for free. You don't have to use a credit card or anything to sign up. You just make an account, you link all of your social media links as well so that we can um, increase your impact score so the higher your score the more likely you will be selected for campaigns and box boxes and so I got this in the box box and I actually did a full review on this as well and I will leave a link down below I love the scent of this now this isn't one that I would say I would wear every single day I would probably wear this one say if you're going out on like a day you know if you're like probably going out in town with your girls it's like that kind of scent and I love the packaging. It's just so freaking cute because it just pops out like that. It's, and first of all, how cute is that? It looks like a freaking purse, y'all. Like, let's get into it. I love it. It's so cute. So, this one is a little bit stronger and it has... They all have a floral scent. That's what I love about it. But this one's kind of like more on like the darker side. Like, like a little bit more like... Again, like I said, like date night is if you're going out on a night of town with your girls, or it's like you're going to like a concert or something like that. You want to be extra cute and spicy and sass. Definitely, this will be um, the fragrance for you. So this is Decadence, and these have been around for a while, you guys. I'm pretty sure you guys have heard of Martin Jacobs, and I actually follow them on Instagram because I just love their packaging. It is so cute, and the scents again there is just so complimentary. I mean, even my girlfriend Alexa wears Martin Jacobs, so. I kind of put her on to it and she just started falling in love and so yeah it just kind of become a staple in our household um yeah so Marc Jacobs I love it again they have various sizes again this is like of course a travel size this is again a deluxe sample size or a travel size I'm not sure it came in an influencer box box and then this is a roller ball so that's not bad at all again I'm not into those big old packaging um Again, I don't wear it every single day. And quite frankly, I really am an oil and butter girl. So I can take my fragrances from that. And that's all I really wear. And then if I decide to wear perfumes or a toilet, that's what I go with is particularly Martin Jacobs. So let me share with you guys my last two fragrances. And the first one I'm going to share with you guys as well. I already have a review on it here on my channel. And this came from Influencer as well. So y'all get into Influencer because y'all can get some stuff for free, okay? Nice stuff. You can review it. And you may like it and you may not like it, but that's okay. Like, it's fun though because you, if you're a person who likes beauty or lifestyle or wellness or anything pretty much on Influencer, you can review and they will pretty much send it to you if they have a campaign that is compatible with you. So check it out. I'll leave my link down below actually. Check out my link. Okay. So this is from Emporio Armani and this is the Because It's You fragrance and of course um, they have the one for the male that complements this one. This is a him and her, you know, fragrance duo. So I have the one for the female and Babe has the one for the male. It's actually in the other bedroom and I do not remember the name of it. I'll put it across the screen here. And yeah, so they pretty much coincide together, you know. And so like we have done that. We have worn them together and separately and they smell really, really nicely. So this one is more of a woody scent. It's like more of like a mahogany scent. It does have some, it does have some floral notes in there as well. And y'all, it just smells so freaking good. So like this one from Marc Jacobs Dickens, I wouldn't say it has like a woody undertone to it or anything like that, but it's kind of like on that, you know, spectrum somewhere along those lines. But this one, it does, and it smells so good though. It has a very soft scent. It's not overpowering. You do not have to wear a whole lot of this. Like literally one to two sprays is all you need, honey. I pretty much spray on each wrist, rub it together, dab, you know, underneath the neck or behind the ears, and you're good to go. Don't overdo it with this one, okay? Because it smells really, really good, and you don't have to wear a whole lot of it. And it's just real sexy, and again, it's like, it's really complimentary, like, with your body chemistry as well. Um, I know for us, particularly for females, I know it smells really, really nicely. Even, again, the male scent, that the one that my girlfriend has, Alexa, 
come uh, I love when she wears that. She doesn't wear it all the time, but when she does, I know instantly what it is. And sometimes I will just go ahead and just wear mine as well so we can kind of compliment each other when we're out in public because we have had people, you know, compliment us on our fragrance. So it does smell really nice and you don't have to wear a whole lot of it. So the next one that I have to share with you guys is actually from Gucci Bloom. It's Gucci, but it's the Gucci Bloom scent. Now y'all don't come for me because my little packaging is starting to peel off because I took it out the box and I just stopped, you know, I just started being lazy and then it started peeling. So don't come for me. But this is literally the scent that I wear every single day. I carry this in my purse and the first time that I was introduced to this was through a Sephora Play Box. And if you guys don't know what Sephora Play Box is, it's pretty much a monthly subscription for $10 and you get five deluxe size samples um beauty samples and they're of again high-end brands you know makeup brands and skincare as well and y'all that's how I got hooked on to it and I fell in love I used the hell out that little sample and I went right to the store and got this one so they got me this actually for Christmas I believe last year yes last year she got for me in 2017 and I love the scent it smells so freaking good it literally smells just like a flower bouquet that is the best way to describe it so if you are a person who loves bouquets or you like to go and buy yourself flowers and you know what i'm talking about because you will probably and more than likely walk through there and smell those bouquet of flowers before you purchase them so this reminds me of that it just smells really fresh alive like if i was to just give it like a color description i guess if you're trying to figure it out probably like red pink blue white like purple like those kind of vibrant lively colors like it just smells just so alive and it just smells so freaking good you guys so i wear this one almost on a daily again this is the gucci bloom scent and i just love it and this is in the rollerball and this one as well was like 33 dollars so um you can get these at pretty much like your um, department stores or you can order them offline or my favorite place to go is sephora where you can just go in there and get your life smell everything you know give stuff a test drive and again a lot of those ladies in there they're experts on this stuff so if you're one of those people who don't wear a lot of perfumes but you're wanting to you know kind of try things out go to sephora those ladies will definitely help you in the back towards back with the fragrance section and they have the rollerball testers out there and even the larger size ones you can smell those and test them out because again everybody's body chemistry is different and not every scent works with everybody so go and try it out you guys and definitely do your research because there are different notes and there are different tones and fragrances with perfumes and toilets because again perfumes are a little bit stronger than toilets because they're a little bit lighter and softer in scents and um all right you guys so i hope you enjoyed today's beauty video um again you guys typically see that i don't upload a lot of beauty content here on my channel and that's just because i really don't do a lot of beauty stuff really and truly i just keep things basic um today i decided to put on a lippy um i'm feeling good feeling creative and i just like yeah let me just put on a lippy to just coincide with the theme today so i hope you guys enjoyed it oh if you're wondering where my shirt is from this is this shirt is from mess in a bottle i got this while we was at essence fest in new orleans so if you haven't seen that vlog i would definitely leave it linked down below for you guys to check it out get your life it was there for four days and it was a lot of fun so check that out and also everything that i shared here in today's video will also be linked down below so i love you queens and i hope you guys enjoyed oh definitely make sure to subscribe if you haven't done so already and make sure you're a part of notification game so you can be notified when i upload new content here on my channel okay you guys so thank you so much for hanging out with me today queens and i'll see you guys in my next video bye you guys Mwah.